Hey guys, if you have this problem, hey Google, play Spotify. Your Spotify account needs to be linked first. You can do that in the Google Home app. Well, there's a fix for that. So we're gonna go throughout a few fixes. So the first one is within your Google Home app. So what we have to go is into your settings. So under your Google Home app, on the top right hand side, you will see settings. Under your settings, we're gonna see all this information. And then on the left side, you're gonna see down here below, it should say music. So as long as you guys go to music, you guys can right here unlink your Spotify account. So you guys can see Spotify is right there and it's selected as my default player. So the first thing you guys should do is unlink and then we're gonna link it back up. So obviously it cannot be your default player in order for you guys to unlink it. So we're just gonna select Google Home, yeah. Just Google Music for now. Then we're gonna unlink this. We're gonna go ahead and unlink. Once it's unlinked, we're gonna link it back up. But remember, this isn't the only fix I'm gonna show you today. I'm gonna show you various fixes. So let's just link it back up. Link account. I should be getting this pop up. Scroll down. Once you hit agree on your Spotify, it should be linked up again. And technically, right now it should be working. However, if it doesn't work, okay, if it's still not working, then we have to go further than that. So what I suggest doing is unplugging and plugging back in your Google Nest Mini from your wall outlet. Or just right here, just unplug it and plug it back in. That way, it's gonna refresh and it might work. So right now, I'm just gonna test it out to see if it's working or not. Hey Google, play Spotify. Your Spotify account needs to be linked first. You can do that in the Google Home app. So as you guys can see, it still doesn't work, right? And let's say you guys tried all that. Well, the last thing we have to do is reset our Nest Mini. Don't be afraid about resetting your Nest Mini because it's very easy and all your stuff is still in your account. So the setup process will be extremely fast. You won't have to do the voice thing again or anything like that. So in order to reset your Nest Mini, we're gonna have to put this on mute first. The mic's off. Okay, so right here on the side, you guys will see where you mute your Nest Mini. And from there, just in case, one more thing before we do this. Nest Mini always has this thing on the back. A Google Home Mini doesn't have this guy. All right. Anyways, right now we're going to reset it. On the middle of our Nest Mini, we're just going to press and hold. Now keep holding and keep holding and you keep holding. You are about to completely reset this device. Release to cancel. And then keep holding until we hear a beep or some type of noise. There we go. So that means it's resetting right now. So it was about five seconds, let's say, that I had to hold it. And from there, I just had to just keep holding until I heard that noise. Once you do that, it's factory resetting. So this is one of the fastest ways to factory reset. And sure, you guys can also use that. Again, it doesn't really matter which color of Nest Mini you guys have. It's the same instructions for all of them. So right now it's resetting. We're just gonna wait for it. And then we just have to set it up again, which is gonna be really fast because everything will be in our app anyways. So our music, our voice commands, everything is already kind of set up. We just have to just sync this up with our app. So we should hear a noise like that. It should tell you to Hi. download the Google to get Home started, app. Download the Google Home app on a phone or tablet. The mic's off. All right, and at this point, we do have to turn on our mic again. So we're just gonna go on the side and turn it the back, mic's on. back on. Perfect, we do need it to be on at this point in time and we're just gonna set it up. So in order to set it up on your iPhone, iPad, iPod Touch, Android device, just go into Wi-Fi, and from your Wi-Fi, you should see something that says like Nest Mini. So here's my Nest Mini. I'm just gonna connect up to it. Once it's connected, we can go ahead into our Google Home app. So we're just waiting for that. But yeah, it has a check mark. So right now on iPhone, iPad, iPod Touch, Android device, just launch your Google Home app. And then we should see Choose a Home, where you're just gonna press Next. Then it's gonna say connecting to your Nest Mini, which is perfect, that's what we want. And you will see that the setup process will be much easier. So I'm gonna press yes, because we heard that sound. 
uh, we're just gonna go yeah it will ask you to select your region then it's gonna ask you where your device is so in this case I think this one was in bedroom so I'm gonna go ahead and hit next then your internet so this is YouTube YT yep there we go next and it's gonna connect once it does that it kind of figures out everything so it's gonna match your voice again because it already has that and it already has your Spotify for example your Google everything it kind of already has because we have done the setup before so this setup is gonna be much much faster so right now it said connected and up here you should see set up Google assistant and we're just gonna hit on next once again once you select next it's gonna tell you this voice match since we've already done that from before, we just have to go on agree and agree again. From here, you should see a message like so, telling you that your voice match is done. You can just press view more for now. Everything is good to go, so you don't really have to select. It should be already selected of what you had from before. So we're just gonna go next. Go next again. And from here, get started. We're just gonna skip this for now, not now might see this, this is basically for spam mail, so no thank you. You're gonna see a message saying almost done, just go next. And from here, it's gonna tell you, learn about your Nest Mini. However, you guys know everything about your Nest Mini, so just keep hitting next, 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 and continue on. Right now I should say bedroom speaker is ready. Next again. Hi, I'm your Google Assistant, here to help. View more. To learn a few things you can Finish do, setup. continue in the Google and with that. app. So right now, as you guys can see, it's back on again. And it should be working at this time. Since we did a factory reset, it should be working. So we're going to test it out. Hey Google, play Spotify. Playing some music on Spotify. Okay, it started to play some music, but because of copyright issues, can't actually show you guys the music that it's playing, but you guys could clearly hear that it did in fact say playing some music from Spotify, which is exactly what we want. And that's how you guys can fix your Nest Mini. Anyways, that would be it for this video. If you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.